so this white collar crime uh, crimes are very dangerous dangerous to the society that i have said uh, therefore uh, normally those who are expert in business or uh, trade uh, profession etc normally resort to such white collar crime so with an intention to earn more money or use money etc it a competitive competitive Yes, in the present field is also the reason for that. Uh, now I am not going back again. Now let us continue. That uh, professional TVs is one such uh, area where you can find the occurrence of uh, white collar crime. Here uh, tax evasion. Those who are having the money, they will try to avoid payment of tax, or, or sometimes they will hide it. Sometimes they Pay, they pay to disclose their income because uh, because various things. First one, normally there are various uh, schemes, rules, regulations by the government regarding uh, tax collection. Uh, complexity of law in the uh, in in the field of uh, uh, levy of uh, tax or uh, collection of uh, tax or uh, etc. are there. Therefore, uh, those peoples. But almost all section having income, they will try to avoid as far as possible uh, the payment of uh, tax. They will hide it. So effort has been made by the government uh, all the time to unearth the black money also. They, 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 this this uh, type of menace is being. Uh, try to be uh, uh, checked by the government by adopting various uh, measures also. Uh, may many incentives in the form of incentives. For example, the uh, VDIS, Voluntary Disclosure of Income Scheme. First time uh, it was 1996, then uh, the United Trend Government uh, uh, announce that uh, scheme so that they, they themselves can disclose uh, their income and uh, assess their income and they pay tax uh, the uh, the amount uh, which is taxable they, that uh, freedom was given to them so it is an incident encouragement uh, so that uh, to prevent the, the people from uh, indulging or uh, not uh, circulating the money uh, which lead to black money uh, because hiding the money is nothing but uh, uh, nothing but uh, it will dis I mean it will disturb the economy also therefore the amount has to be invested so many all are, all of you are aware yeah, around three and a half years back. Uh, the de no demonetization of uh, uh, the notes of 1500 denomination. Uh, that was also aimed as part of curbing black money uh, also. So they are indulged by those who are skilled in all the fields, businessmen, tradesmen, professionals, uh, experts. Uh, Politicians, we all the bureaucrats also. Bureaucrats, perhaps they may have their source of income on record, they can. Uh, but uh, those, uh, even another, in the another, another sector also, uh, hiding the money. So it was in a uh, part. So therefore, in uh, RK Gork uh, case, uh, the Social Bearer Bond Act in that case. Uh, the Supreme Court has upheld that act uh, because of, um, to prevent the because in that case uh, the, the the to prevent the tax evasion in future and in during the past uh, or the past uh, evasion past uh, disclosure uh, failing to disclose their income uh, during the previous assessment years. They are given an opportunity, but uh, it has also uh, been uh, uh, unsuccessful to some extent. 
because of uh, fear of uh, reopening the uh, 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 assessment of uh, the income of the people also. Therefore, whatever the measures taken, that's a vision uh, because sometimes, uh, as you know, that uh, uh, this is the biggest source uh, tax, is the biggest source, statutory duty uh, complied by the citizens compulsory, which uh, forms the biggest source to the government. So, at the same time, the people involved it. So, many actions are taken, they are trying their level best, but uh, we must, uh, as a part of uh, prevention of white collar crime in this field, we must educate the uh, those who are eligible in paying the tax, they are, uh, who are having tax free income. Uh, therefore, some sort of uh, 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 educating them uh, regarding all laws, uh, complexity, piling, e-piling, new systems are introduced. They are confusion, confusion is there. Therefore, um, this also occurs because of that. So, uh, it, is, uh, uh, it is to be uh, understood in this way that uh, um, deviating, uh, avoiding the rules, uh, uh, also it is also their duty, everyone has a duty. So they are failing to duty in uh, making uh, payment of tax to the government uh, for whatever reasons. The reasons are many, uh, also lead to white collar crimes. Next comes uh, the educational uh, institutions. Educational institutions, as you are all aware, there are many educational institutions uh, managed by the government, semi-government, uh, even the private managements are there, running education, running uh, uh, many education institutions in uh, India. So, the, there are uh, uh, tendency that uh, then now, now it is there, it, it is there everywhere that uh, 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 the management private management, particularly uh, involving uh, uh, such anti-activities, uh, the activities prevented by law in the, in the, in the, in the process of uh, appointment of uh, teachers, uh, in the process of uh, offering a course, uh, in the process of uh, collecting a fees, uh, tuition fees, uh, excessive tuition fees, uh, or even the process of uh, uh, taking admission of those who are not eligible for the said course. Uh, sometimes dummy candidates will be there. So only uh, some, uh, the, everything, they will see the records, they will prepare the record in such a way that uh, uh, the authority should not doubt about the existence of uh, the institution itself. Uh, as you know, that uh, there are some courses offered, but there will be no students. But they will give some time the names of some dummy students. Actually, they are not training. Uh, there are many, and uh, in the process of teachers also not paying the salary prescribed by the uh, government norms. Uh, Sometimes they are taking the making use of those teachers uh, over bur burden. Over, they will uh, extract work. Uh, more work uh, from the teaching staff, even non-teaching staff also, uh, more work uh, no, from the teaching staff, non-teaching staff, uh, extracting work from them. This is also, that is also not permitted because uh, working more, getting less uh, in terms of remuneration is not uh, conducive uh, effect in the present uh, society. Therefore, it is expected that uh, uh, education institutions should run institutions in such a way that they uh, should not uh, cause any injustice to ultimately suffer will be the students. There are many institutions, they say they will provide so so uh, uh, curriculum to the students, uh, academic work, etc. But in practice nothing will be there. 
they are only issuing the mass card degree certificates without being actually uh, conducted the course itself so because they have a tendency to earn money uh, because i did not explain it again perhaps you have you have you have seen it uh, in these days how the education institutions are there they have become the uh, education itself has been commercialized nowadays uh, they have become the factories a center for earning the money only so uh, their motto should have been a service they should be they should have been their motto should have been to render service to the uh, students or society also as such but uh, despite this uh, ultimately uh, we see uh, there will be no recognition to the meritorious candidates also they only accept those uh, with uh, financial in the, those students who can uh, who, who can uh, donate so more and more money to the institution so by ignoring the uh, meritorious candidates or the common or or out of sub today nowadays so therefore uh, i uh, because what they say is uh, even i can also say that uh, cooperation from the public in all respect uh, is a necessary is necessary is expected is indiv- indispensable no to prevent white collar crimes it is very difficult to say all those things i don't know to what extent uh, there will be cooperation because there are some people they will try to disclose uh, another the the this the scam in the education department to itself sometimes they won't hold an examination itself because it was reported in many newspapers also you might have heard uh, uh, even the evaluation process there also there are some irregularities so with the active complaints by the education institutions education institutions are almost nowadays backed by some big person some big uh, politicians also they know how to escape from whatever legal um, uh, uh, compulsion they they will try to avoid they know they will escape from the legal impediment they know that's why uh, very institutions are there uh, behind them uh, uh, big persons involved influential politicians will be there therefore uh, these are all the regions uh, so normally it will increase the white collar crimes therefore you can't uh, uh, prevent it prevention is possible but it is very different so i told you it is different from ordinary crimes so therefore uh, it is better to prevent it rather than uh, i mean uh, uh once uh, the crime has taken place uh, i think uh, no solution will be there uh, either because uh, in law it is uh, uh, difficult to pa- punish them difficult to book them also because you can't identify the act committed at various level uh, at various stages therefore you can't hold so legally speaking very difficult uh, so perhaps if anything anything happens uh, so the victims ultimately will be the sufferer therefore uh, it is advisable and desirable also that uh, much precautions should be taken even by the uh, society uh, in particularly with the education institutions uh, uh, therefore Mm, how it has to be done many laws are there many rules and regulations are also issued from time to time by the government also that should be followed strictly so uh, the, the strict law is also the reason for white collar crime so how let us see so to deviate they will try to deviate it they will try to bypass the strict rules also 
that can also be often can be called as a one uh, uh, thing, uh, one, one, one region for entrancing the Vaikava Prime also because in the previous the introductory chapter itself I told you, I told you uh, the region for white collar crime. Now, uh, white collar crime in the trade and business, and what it is in all the business trade, it is already there. Say, adulterated uh, uh, items are there, puts are there, uh, sometimes uh, time barred goods are being sold, expired goods are being sold, sometimes the uh, quantity, quality problems are there because. As you know that sale of goods act is there, consumer protection act is there, and the MRTP act is also there to protect the interest of the consumer, the customers, etc., rights and liabilities of the buyers. So you are all aware. Therefore, so you, I, you are also, sometimes they were without the license, sometimes without uh, uh, any, uh, because nowadays uh, they have introduced the, the GST also in business. That has to be followed also. They can't bypass it. Though the government is taking the steps uh, to prevent such occurrence of white collar crime, even in trained business, it's very difficult. You can't uh, fix, uh, you can't say it's unlimited area. Trading and business, uh, how sometimes the, the customers or uh, your consumers are misled. They are given a wrong information also. The information will be misleading sometimes. They will hide. They will suppress So uh, how how means they know because in the process of because they are aimed to achieve something something more. And, uh, I mean aim aim to achieve earn earn use money in the business or this uh, even in the trading uh, in trade and business space. Therefore, uh, also there, uh, we have several uh, legislations also here to prevent it. Uh, act uh, uh, only by legislation it is not possible. Uh, there must be a, a will power uh, by the by all section uh, to see that it should not occur. And common people should not be the sufferer. Therefore, I did not explain because you are all aware everything you are here, rules, regulations, are there to be, those, those should be followed also. Uh, you almost, next, uh, computer related uh, white collar crimes. Computer related white collar crimes, uh, you are all aware nowadays. Uh, nowadays, uh, hacking information, uh, uh, here, hackers are the stalking. Uh, see, before that, uh, you see, uh, in, in, during 1990, first, uh, first time, we came to know virus. That is the love bug virus 2000. It was there. Uh, hacking information. So, data itself will be changed. Uh, uh, now, computer is there nowadays. Uh, uh, many uh, software. Uh, came uh, giving this see hackers other information will be taken uh, uh, through a technological mode uh, without there being any physical process it is very difficult who, who has done that it is also there you know it uh, everybody has put now you know there will be misuse of credit cards the team cards who are all aware, uh, there will be um, debit card misuse of for those. Uh, uh, Sometimes uh, bank transactions. You shall without. Sometimes you are all aware. Uh, withdrawing your money uh, belong to somebody else. Uh, 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 Everything every day you hear those things happen. They are happen. They, are, they, are, they happen every day. Uh, uh, you see, sending him uh, some information, message uh, to uh, those who are unwilling to unwilling to receive those message. 
talk unnecessarily uh, uh, misleading in uh, you are because you are aware that some messages you are, you message you receive unnecessarily they say that uh, uh, there are some opportunities so those bogus opportunities uh, they will hack the information they will get the uh, get the information regarding uh, financial i mean your account balance etc uh, it will be taken who has taken it is not possible because without uh, physical uh, presence through technological mode they involve uh, where every day we hear those things so universal chat email security information so your information are also taken to their own technological system money laundering the prevention money laundering act itself is there uh, there is a act is there you know that uh, um, there is a uh, provision uh, how how to transact with the money also because uh, we are here that uh, many politicians are being booked under the money laundering act there is a process therefore uh, it is very difficult uh, one to uh, government level they are trying their level best uh, data digging substitution updating or changing the data itself so every day it happens so because you are aware that uh, in whatever manner Mm. physical presence will not be there but uh, through their own uh, high, highly sophisticated technology is used to seek information extract information personal information regarding their personal uh, property uh, maybe more than movable so uh, there are technology that uh, the 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 name will be changed uh, technologies that they will create a document uh, create a documents regarding property they will send it so uh, even the fingerprint impression will also be they will try to update the thumb impression also uh, so that uh, they can't be they can't be uh, uh, they can't be fixed with the criminal liability so many many more and more development in technology creating more and more problem in the society leading to the uh, leading to i mean that is that that is encouraging the commission of white collar Right. Uh, you know, uh, my dear friends, uh, this is this topic itself uh, is uh, it has uh, unlimited issues. So within a particular frame of framework, you can't uh, read it. It touches each and every uh, stages uh, in the society. You know, almost all the sector section also, almost all. therefore uh, i am just giving some hints how where what when the crime take place so i put in in short uh, to 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 sum up uh, i can say that uh, this is a very very dangerous than the ordinary crime there only those who are expert skilled the upper strata people the highly socio economic uh, uh, um, people are using or involving indulging uh, encouraging for sake of their own interest their own interest in the competitive field there are many reasons therefore um, i have to say uh, directly 
offenses are committed they can be dealt with by the ordinary laws but uh, these are all the crimes you can't say that crime has taken place you can come to know only when they and uh, only after several years because investigation requires to be done after thorough investigation the judge's report only is first uh, only much to say for oh, so much of uh, mistakes were committed intentionally because of that uh, loss has happened like that uh, uh, i am only asking uh, you that uh, you can read whichever books available in the library you can download uh, many information relating to white for a crime uh, through very uh, from where may many websites uh, you can read from the academic uh, point of view from the knowledge point of view so uh, this is the area uh, we can use some hints the way the margin one skeleton how the topic is so you can search more and more things you you will find out you will get more and more things uh, in this white collar crime every time at each point of time at every stage the crimes are uh, taken place so therefore uh, sometime these are happened intentionally sometime these are uh, unexpectedly ha uh, sometime unexpectedly happen the this uh, crime but result is same uh, ultimately uh, it will cause huge loss to the society as the point ultimately so in that view of the matter uh, we only request i i can only request that uh, from the examination point of view uh, you can just uh, note down certain things and just uh, you uh, your reasons uh, and the consequences of uh, this white collar crime uh, therefore uh, everything cannot be explained now each and everything every day appears in newspaper also uh, uh okay after i told you in medical uh i am a doctor but how they because of, if a doctor does not disclose regarding the uh, any symptoms led to during the corona uh, because recently we are aware that uh, though the patient has corona victims the hospital the doctor did not disclose it it is not pens now so failing to disclose it now what happened that has spread many people were come in come, uh, come in touch with those diseases nothing but uh, indirectly the government has to seal down that particular area sealing to that particular area means entire business all the activities has come to a standstill no improvement no business activities no developments Now how the people should live because when economic activities are are come are coming to a standstill nothing therefore the the deviating from the norms mm-hmm. uh, normally that encourage white collar crime as you suppose so it happened in bangor you know the area has to be seen it down that has to be because now all attack at all the activities were prevented they are not permitted by the government the people in that particular locality what they have to do for their livelihood so for the people like people who are below particularly the poor people will be the victim therefore there is a direct consequence do not directly but indirect act activities or uh, have a direct impact on these people on these people therefore you are all aware uh, if a person commits because nowadays uh, the responsibility of uh, the doctors 
the very important police also all the officers also they have to follow whatever the uh, uh, orders issued by the government from time to time failing which uh, like that if uh, the authorities fail to prevent the movement of a person with a corona symptom what will happen so that will spread another area wherever that person goes again the entire area has to be put under containment zone no activities will be there during that period till uh, the disease is cured therefore far reaching consequences will be there if you fail to follow the rules and regulation even in the medical field also therefore wide area i am giving you some hints you are all aware uh, how it has because throughout the country uh, because during that that uh, that disease has equal responsibility is there even on the person who has uh, that symptom yes it is true or in respect to our uh, government all the common people every one goes a duty towards uh, the uh, uh, go state also because our constitution while providing the rights duties are also there they are expected to discharge their duties therefore one person who came to karnataka from saudi arabia in gulbarga he is the first person who died in karnataka Karnataka. That person would have taken the care and caution. He must have. There is also a failure by those people. Also, that person failed in his duty. Constitutionally, uh, certain duties are also given. When the duties are not discharged, right cannot be claimed. Actually, both are interconnected. Rights and duties. When there is a right, there will be duty. Therefore, uh, each, every one. Uh, should keep in mind uh, and discharge their obligation uh, for the common cause of the public also. Therefore, generally I am speaking. I am not particular about those things. We are all aware for uh, for the past fifty six uh, days what has been happened in our country. Therefore, the poor people are struggling for livelihood, day to day uh, meal. Therefore. because of mistake of some people some officer sometimes so allowing the those people with corona symptom to move some other uh, place some other district some other country uh, because of negligence on part of the officers also you know what would be the result spreading a disease what would be the consequences you know everything uh, in these days therefore uh, I think I need to explain it again. You are all aware. You are all aware. Therefore, uh, keep in all those aspects in your mind. Um, you know, in a in day to day life, everyone has a duty. Uh, everyone has a duty to prevent or or at least to bring the notice of the authorities any situations which are likely to encourage the white collar crime in the. this day sir okay uh let me conclude uh up to this uh, uh i will continue in my next uh, class uh i have to say one thing that uh, mm, you can read whichever book available in the library uh, you can also download those information from various uh, various uh, website also uh, uh, because uh, you can also make a research also is a new topic uh, new topic the new issue new area many issues are there uh, which are uh, determining the, the entire economy of the country if uh, the white collar crime crimes are allowed to happen therefore right Uh, let me say briefly as you know that to white collar crime uh, these crimes are different from ordinary crimes therefore 
these are all committed by people of highly respectability and high social economic uh, by the people having a high social economic uh, status so so has to the ultimate aim will be to earn use money or profit therefore uh, you there are many regions which i have already explained to you for contributing white collar crime but now topic wise i am discussing now i am read i am explaining now now the 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 what uh, the year denying guilty mind i already told you to establish a guilty guilt of the accused is the important aspect to convict a person so normally they will deny it even in the ordinary uh, crimes also before the court proceedings they will deny they will plead, they, they claim to uh, to be tried here also they will deny they are guilty there also they will deny they are guilty so by the people in the course of their vigilance or any their uh, professional professional act in their professional activities uh, they indulge various activities by 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 sometimes by giving a uh, uh, misleading advertisement sometimes concealing the certain facts sometimes uh, suppressing hiding in whatever manner to attract the public ultimately they will achieve something something in their aim is to earn money that's all that's the main aim here so here the business people normally because they are in the in the in the, in, in the in the position that they will influence even the policy makers also making a policy even by the government sometime they will influence how much what to be done uh, they will dictate the terms how the terms and conditions should be there because they are the person they are influencing class influencing people therefore already told you in education institution also in all other profession there are some there are some classes uh, they will be influenced for example in education institutions uh, almost all the politicians uh, uh, are having their own educational institution so many is you every day you hear in newspaper also it comes uh, that uh, many medical institutions colleges uh, are backed by uh, politicians nowadays you are aware so many activities anti social activities are done to block the see medical seat also it is happening in karnataka also investigation is going on you will come to know so by the time the investigation comes everybody will target all those things that is another biggest drawback in the process of investigation into the white collar crime so therefore normally to establish a guilt is it not it is very difficult here therefore there is a public apathy also because of the that reason that the memory of the public is very short first of all and investigation will take a long period by the time it gives a report perhaps the over the people perhaps may not remember what was the uh, crimes at that time so another thing is uh, uh, there is there is a uh, uh, one more aspect is there the people will forward one but uh, uh, public will also public will also contribute yesterday i told you that uh, white collar crimes are happen not by one side but the public will also contribute so i will give one example today you may have heard uh, seen uh, it was reported also a patient corona patient is uh, in the quarantine uh, home so to escape from that there is a deal 
with the officers. Today only it is reported from Bangalore. It has become all India news also. So he is demanding 27,000 rupees. How he is calculating? For 14 days, the patient has to be there in the uh, uh, hotel. So in terms of uh, money, how much the person will incur? So based on that, he is fixing. Therefore, means, means what? They are also contributing towards uh, the commission of white color crime. Because even the Prevention of Corruption Act itself says that the person who gives and the person who takes bribe, both are equal held liable. Under law, it is there. Therefore, we can't blame the one side. They are also, sometimes they will see that uh, they are getting any relief at the earliest. Uh, they will bypass the rules. Sometimes we will go to the extent of uh, bribing the officers also. So there is also a mistake. There is also a contribution by the public also. Therefore, public apathy is there. Uh, what they will have to do? Firstly, it will take a long period to conclude investigation to find out the guilt, uh, guilty person one. And by the time the result comes, perhaps they will forget it. The public memory is short and public will also cooperate. Therefore, in these days, there is no mechanism strictly to enforce laws against uh, the white collar crimes. Because uh, those crimes are, have the patronage of uh, some influential people. They will halt the process of uh, investigation. Therefore, it is very difficult. Uh, so, everyone, including on both sides, should have a will to prevent the occurrence of a white collar crime. This is the main throwback you are now also that uh, no mechanism is there strictly to enforce a law against uh, those who indulge white collar crime. That is why you know, I am only saying what is there, what is not there. But in practice it is also very difficult. So you will come to know because uh, uh, when you will become a lawyer, you will come to know what happens in the society, how to deal with, with the situation like this, you will come to know. But uh, uh, nowadays many programs are taken by the government, many laws are also there, all the officers are also becoming uh, uh, stricter now, efficient officers are also appointed for that purpose, uh, yet a uh, uh, few persons are involved by passing, deviating the norms, rules, regulations, ethics, etc. in the professional field. Because of that it happens. Therefore, anonymously, everybody should pledge that uh, uh, this should not uh, happen in the near future, the only. So, self-control, so self-imposition, self-restriction uh, towards uh, such a crime. Uh, so that the uh, crime should be prevented is the only remedy. Laws are there, but enforcement agency sometimes will delay because of influence by bureaucrats, influence by politicians, etc. etc. Many but there are many things which uh, many factors are there. Those factors will influence. That is why my only uh, request uh, because uh, we are reading it uh, in the in, in the academic uh, uh, discipline we are reading, but uh, actually in practice uh, the contribution from all the section is required to prevent occurrence of white collar crimes. I have to say one more thing. What happened in Maharashtra in 1980s is one incident. Still it is there, it is further advanced nowadays. Uh, some examples we must give, we must read that also. In Maharashtra, due to uh, uh, renal failure, because kidney failure, kidney problems, kidney problems, due to that, after consuming 
medicine like uh, this one, glycerol, is the medicine. So after consuming 14 patients died uh, because of uh, uh, that disease uh, after consuming this uh, medicine. Therefore in Maharashtra, Mar then Maharashtra government appointed a commission headed by Justice Bhaktava Lenti. So he looked into this uh, aspect, uh, examined all the aspect uh, and also examined many witnesses, around 120 witnesses uh, in the medical fields, so doctors and patients, uh, public officers uh, also. And, uh, sought many documents pertaining to medical records of those people, those patients who died, everything. There was a delay even by officers in submitting the information to this commission to find out what happened, what was the reason for that uh, uh, death. So anyway, ultimately after about 17 months, they were able to give a report and found the reasons. They say that uh, the medication which was you administered, that is glycerol, was adulterated with uh, dithylene dithylene uh, medication. So that should have been naturally used by for industrial purpose. Uh, that was wrongly used, wrongly administered because of that. So it was found that uh, the manufacturers are mingled. One. Secondly, the, there is a violation of rules and regulations. Uh, because it says manufacturers were involved there. Uh, uh, many officers who are involved here, because the committee found that there, there was a, there was a, uh, the, the prosecutions were deferred. Officers were mingled. Manufacturers were also mingled. So there is before using it, the what the committee found that the, the that uh, medicine was not uh, tested. Therefore, it was found many mistakes were found. Ultimately, the commission found that is found the certain officers, professors in this health department, even the university level officers, they found the officer responsible for that. So, the family inquiry was also initiated, but uh, finally, uh, unexpectedly, uh, to, to our surprise, uh, even in the department inquiry, they were exonerated from uh, the uh, responsibility. Because, uh, as I told you, that uh, it is very difficult to inflict or uh, fix a liability in white collar crimes on particular person because uh, I already told you before this uh, long delay will be there in the pra in prosecution, long delay in investigation. So even the witnesses will pause the gate. Uh, if, uh, you are, you, uh, if you were to examine the witness uh, after 10 years uh, from the date of occurrence of the incident, perhaps a uh, witness normally may not be able to remember those things, uh, to say something before the commission or before the investigating agency or before the uh, court also. Therefore, the uh, biggest, very, very important aspect, important drawbacks uh, is uh, that uh, uh, this is the major reasons uh, that uh, we are unable to uh, fix uh, criminal liability on those things. Therefore, is very important uh, aspect. So, in this aspect, uh, the committee also found that uh, there will be ministerial interference also. So, in place of ministers are there. So, without proper care and caution, care and caution, without proper test, the medicines are used. Therefore, the 14 patient died in hospital. Sorry, not right, hospital. Hospital. In Bombay, in Maharashtra, it happened. Therefore, uh, in, you can see anywhere in elsewhere, there is no limit for the subject. So, the, some examples, some incidents, I am going, I am writing in the 
uh, in the classroom. That's all. So you can hear so many uh, news every day. So that now I told you that uh, a patient uh, is offering to pay a price. So there is a dealing also, bargaining for the amount to escape from the quarantine. So if in a situation like this, uh, uh, whom should be blamed? Uh, so it is very difficult to uh, understand. Therefore, uh, nowadays, uh, white collar crime exists everywhere, elsewhere, everywhere in all the fields, in all the sections. Therefore, uh, uh, the, the people should, everyone uh, should take a decision uh, and uh, try to avoid the happening of such an event. They must try to discourage also uh, this, uh, the activities uh, leading to white collar crimes. So therefore, uh, about this aspect, uh, again some substance I already told you that it is very, it is very where white collar crimes are dangerous than the ordinary crimes. So, he, he, personal gain, earnings more or huge profit, probably maybe the reasons or in the I don't know, sometimes the prestige will also be the reasons for white collar crime. So I, I already told you prestige, but he is not willing to budge, not willing to accept the reality in the region also. So political regions are also, psychological regions, political, socio-economic regions are there. Religion is also one of the regions for uh, white collar crime. I already told you, all those things are there. Therefore, the cost is also another region. So nationality is also another region. So that will influence this white collar crimes in the business field, the competitive area, the competitive area. So sorry, competitive area now. Therefore, as you know that uh, uh, what the China, there is an indication that the coronavirus has come from China. Uh, you are aware that uh, it is uh, 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 it is uh, uh, from China, uh, which has been spread throughout the country. This is not the natural disease; it is a created one. Uh, it is produced in a lab in China. There are allegations. Ultimate aim of the China is that uh, they want to be a superpower in the world. That is the aim. That is the aim. To do that, uh, they have what they have done. They have spread the disease uh, to which uh, there is no medicine. The medicine still has not been uh, uh, invented so as to curb the menace of uh, corona. So, best example, I think we are aware. Why China is doing it? Because the uh, aim is that they want to be a superpower in the world. That is the reason. Therefore, the entire world is uh, under the reel of uh, this uh, uh, corona issues, corona disease. Uh, many countries, many countries, as you know, that uh, there are many corona cases increasing day by day, even in India also. Even in India also, increasing day by day. So, see, the menace of corona, which has been from the China. The China is the cause. There is a fight. Uh, almost all the countries, uh, America uh, is raising this issue, um, blaming the WHO, uh, raising this issue, and uh, once that uh, compensation has to be paid from the China also for the last occurred because of corona disease. As you know, every day you are here. So I, I need not explain it once again. That can, that can be the best reasons. Why it happened? Because of that. I am only academically discussing here. So nothing more than that. Therefore, I don't know. Uh, but everything should come by investigation. Uh, many countries want investigation also. Whether they, this is the uh, natural disease or the disease which which the China is not responsible for the target it has to be seen. Present allegation is that it is uh, created, it is produced in a lab in China.
uh, to Yuvana city. That's what they say. It has to be seen. Now it's very difficult to uh, even investigate. I just know I told you that uh, at the various levels investigation will, will be there. So who are responsible like that and uh, to what extent they should be held liable. It is very difficult. difficult. Therefore I am uh, uh, stating always that uh, best example Corona, China, the America research because WHO, the allegation against the WHO that, that they delayed in declaring that the disease is the uh, 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 it is a, uh, a disease in the world uh, uh, disease the WHO has declared already uh, there is a they, they took a decision lately after the death of several uh, uh, people there is also allegation indirectly WHO has also contributed it's what they say it is appeared in newspapers what I'm saying I don't know but uh, what happened today so far I'm telling to you I'm saying so you in the next few days you will come to know who is responsible for the spreading of disease etc so even in our country also uh, some elements are there they are intentionally spreading by not following the uh, the the uh, rules and regulations regarding corona because uh, government has announced that uh, everybody should follow the rules that is maintaining social distance uh, wearing mask and uh, uh, medical test and uh, one has to uh, complete a 14 days quarantine period not following, we are escaping. I just want to give one example. There, is, there are bribes to escape from that. These are all instances. Not following the government orders day by day. Not observing the rules and regulations. Lockdown has been introduced. It is uh, uh, announced by the central government, by many governments, the state government also. It has to be followed. There will be a flagrant violation. Instant, I mean, every time. There are many cases, many news comes. Instances of violating. So, uh, you would have heard that you may not maintain social distance, uh, passengers are getting into the bus. So, it is very difficult uh, to fix. There are many other regions. Therefore, I have told you, the white collar crimes uh, are dangerous. Once the disease is attacked, what will happen, you know, I knew to explain it. But uh, ordinary crimes, you can fix a person, criminally liable, and maybe a punisher also, if proved. But it is, proving itself is very difficult. Therefore, the only solution is that prevention is better. See that it is not uh, spread, so it is uh, not attacking you. That is the only solution here. That's what the every day the government is saying, or the department is saying, everyone is saying that we have to follow. Anyway, so now I will switch over to another topic. Uh, actually, that uh, topic uh, is uh, regarding uh, the professional deviance continuation lawyers I already told you as per uh, the lawyers are they are also the professionist uh, they are in, in, in briefly I had explained it but uh, white collar crimes are also committed by some lawyers also. not many lawyers some lawyers not all some lawyers they are resorted to because of many regions, I told you, regions are many, we are not concerned with that. But uh, to prevent, because lawyers, once a graduate, law graduate, enrolled himself to be an advocate, he is expected to follow certain values, ethics, rules, regulations, prescribed by the profession. 
He is respected. Moral values are also there. So his utmost aim is to protect the interest of his client. That should be the main aim. Because he owes a duty not only to his client, but also towards the public, towards the state, towards the opponent also. Therefore, he owes a duty towards the society, that I told you. So he has, because he is also called as office, he is an officer, he is an officer, he is an officer of the court. He owes, a, he is not an ordinary man, compared to other citizens. He has a certain responsibility. So he has to follow. He has to follow that. Therefore, if there is any allegations, bypassing those deviating, those norms, values, rules, regulations, will also contribute. How, in what way you are aware. Already told you. Now, the two to curb, to contain it, uh, there is uh, provisions uh, under the Advocates Act 1951, presently. If a lawyer commits uh, in the course of his profession any misconduct, that lawyer, I mean, that person can be dealt with uh, under the Advocate, uh, Advocate, uh, Advocate Act 1951. For the professional misconduct, section 35, 36, various provisions are there. I am dealing with particular, particular provisions, I am only 11 provisions, I am going to touch now. There is a provision that if a person commits, a, any lawyer commits a professional misconduct, the, any a complaint can be lodged by uh, the client against the advocate, lodging a complaint by the client against his advocate is a per, per profession misconduct is permitted under the Advocate Act. You know, sometimes the court also, while hearing the case, if the advocate found to have committed a professional misconduct, the court can also refer the matter for, 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 uh, taking an action under the Advocate Act. Advocate Act provides that uh, there is a forum. There will be a disciplinary committee constituted by the State uh, Bar Council and also the disciplinary committee constituted by the Bar Council of uh, India. There are two forums. So initially, large a complaint uh, before the disciplinary committee of the State Bar Council against the advocate. So then uh, the committee will look into this uh, that uh, complaint. If there is any substance, the notice will notices will be issued to the concerned advocate. After uh, examining oral and documentary evidence, the disciplinary committee has the power to reprimand the counsel had the power to suspend a council permanently or temporarily or a particular period. Sometimes if uh, the committee finds that there is no substance, uh, the committee can uh, dismiss the complaint. So the disciplinary committee of the state bar council, the decisions of the disciplinary committee of the bar council, state bar council, will be in the nature of a civil punishment. So criminal, criminal action cannot be taken uh, by the disciplinary committee because that is not uh, permitted under law. Within one year, the State Park Council has to decide. Suppose the State Park Council fails to decide within one year, then the matter will be automatically transferred to the Bar Council of India, that is the disciplinary committee constituted by the Bar Council of uh, India, which will pro continue the proceedings from the state, from the stage where it was stopped. Then BCI, I mean this will be committee of Bar Council of India, can decide the case. Suppose the any decision is given by the state bar, disciplinary committee of the state bar council, that decisions will be 
can be challenged by the aggrieved party before the next uh, that is appeal by way of appeal before the disciplinary committee of bar council. Thereafter, if anybody is aggrieved, their person can approach the Supreme Court also. That provision is there. Suppose in a case where the state the disciplinary committee of the state bar council failed to decide a case within one year, as I told you, that matter will go to that will be transferred to the Bar Council of India's Disciplinary Committee, the Disciplinary Committee of the Bar Council of India, who will continue proceeding from the stage where it was stopped before the Disciplinary Committee of State Bar Council. The Bar the Disciplinary Committee of the Bar Council of India will continue proceeding, will decide the case, uh, can decide, just now I told you, can reprimand the council, can dismiss the complaint, can suspend the advocate, he may, may be uh, strike out from the role uh, permanently or temporarily, like that uh, punishment, uh, like in this way, can be given. So, a group party can approach the Supreme Court also. That is the procedure. But uh, before doing this, uh, uh, as uh, you are all aware, that uh, principles of natural justice is there. Only after hearing the concerned party, the all the parties, because uh, there is already a term part where hearing should be given, is it not? No one shall be judge of his own case, like that. You are all aware. Fair hearing, right to hearing, reason for the decisions uh, should be given. These are the basic uh, aspects of uh, the various components of uh, principles of natural justice. Therefore, it should be followed because when the committee of the state bar council or the bar, uh, bar council of India are deciding uh, the cases relating to uh, professional misconduct, the alleged professional misconduct, alleged to have been coming, uh, uh, by, uh, alleged to have been committed, or alleged by his clients, etc. So. They are required, their committees are required to follow the process. It is prescribed also. So, in respect of getting, uh, securing uh, uh, attendance of witness, securing documents, uh, compelling attendance of uh, etc., issuing summons, etc., all those things, uh, what CPC says, uh, is also applicable. Same system he is here. Only in some instructions, I can say, after following the uh, those principles, I mean, principles of natural justice, uh, the committee will uh, decide as far as uh, the alleged mis professional misconduct of uh, a lawyer because it is provided. Therefore, there are uh, many cases uh, because you you have already studied in professional ethics, uh, those cases are there. So, suppose uh, you, uh, uh, professional misconduct. So there is no in a particular definition what constitutes professional misconduct also it is not really stated. But uh, having regard to the nature of act committed by the advocate, we can decide, we can say, we can say that it comes. So it comes within the meaning of the uh, within the meaning of the word professional misconduct. From time professional misconduct, because there are many cases, uh, they are decided by the State Bar Council, Disciplinary Committee of the State Bar Council, Disciplinary Committee of the Bar Council of India in a transfer case, even the Supreme Court also. Uh, there are many cases which we have studied. So sometimes oh, conducting case uh, negligently, uh, not conducting the case, or uh, uh, sometimes not piling the case itself, sometimes not bringing evidence of, uh, the evidence before the court. Uh, in the court, uh, in, in the in the proceedings, uh, uh, there are many issues. Sometimes not attend the cases uh, without a justifiable cause, uh, or all are regarded as professional misconduct. Therefore, here, uh, Supreme Court, apart from this uh, one, uh, the advocate they have their own ethics uh, to be followed during the or uh, before the court proceedings also. He, though he is an officer of the court, he is also expected to follow that uh, towards the court also. So sometimes blaming the judge or personally attacking the judge. Many instances we have studied in the last semester itself. So the court can 
in apart from referring the matter to the bar council for 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 preparation misconduct the court can also initiate uh, uh, contempt proceedings contempt or criminal uh, uh, contempt case can because it is offense therefore here it is an offense under the contempt of court act criminal contempt case can be initiated by the presiding officer of the court if they come to the if they find that the advocate was guilty of profession misconduct in the course of his profession at the time of conducting the case in the open court so court can court can punish punish means it proves in criminal contempt that is that punishment will be almost in the nature of a uh, criminal nature that because it shall says that criminal criminal contempt case but uh, when it comes to the advocate act uh, civil nature of punishment uh, like uh, suspending temporarily permanently or a particular period or reprimanding or may dismiss a complaint if not proved about the uh, approved the misconduct profession misconduct that type of punishment is there provided under the advocate act 1951 but under the contempt of court act a advocate is bound or is proved of course it is proved against an advocate uh, for the alleged uh, committing a, a contempt the person can be punished by the court therefore i think i need not explain again it because i have studied in the last chapter also is nothing but repetition to conclude it i have to explain all those things are uh, 10 cases also you have already studied i uh, but some substance is that uh, the, the, the the crimes are also committed by this class of professional professions professionals that in legal uh, the person legal practitioners also but uh, i am not saying that all are involved but there are instances where even liars also and committed profession and conduct there are many cases even no pending uh, we are going on cases are being still uh, examined by the committees therefore so i think uh, uh, this is all regarding uh, this uh, particular aspect uh, okay uh, so i repeat once again no mechanism is there even now to prevent the occurrence of white collar crime even now because no mechanism is there to strictly implement the rules and laws against those who commit uh, the white collar crime because uh, i already told you the, the the persons responsible for white collar crimes are backed by influential people influential categories of persons say for example politicians bureaucrats etc therefore very very difficult therefore it is advisable and desirable that everyone should take a precautionary uh, uh, before uh, the incident occur therefore in before the incident occur so therefore um, it is such a subject it uh, touches each and every aspect in your day to day life everywhere it exist therefore every time inch to inch one should be one should be alert about the activities and crazy white collar crime